welcome to all the people that follow us through IMR Press Global Media. Here we are at the BID 2019 International Quality Convention of Paris. We have the opportunity, the honor and the pleasure to talk to Mr. Dima Non from Coffee Mondelkuri and Mrs. Shanti Om from Coffee Mondelkuri, who has just recently been awarded with the BID International Quality Award. Uh, it's an honor, it's a pleasure. Please do tell us a little bit about Coffee Mondelkuri, what do you do in Cambodia, what is your company's history, and which do you believe are the key elements for quality in your organization? Uh, our coffee established in 2008, and uh, uh, in the past, so our, uh, she is uh, my mom, Yes, yeah, we have a family business. Yes, and uh, in the past, so we, uh, we 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 have the small restaurant. In the past, so we in Cambodia use uh, the coffee uh, from other uh, other country like uh, Thailand, like Vietnam. But uh, from uh, but uh, our vision that I see that uh, why Cambodia have the coffee farm, but why don't produce uh, the Cambodian products? So we start we start to have uh, roasting. Yeah, in 2008, and uh, uh, from 2008-2011, so the people start to focus on my my products mm -hmm. because of the quality is uh, is the best and the close uh, uh, quality like cof coffee from other country. So, Mr. Shantion, can you tell us which one do you think is was the key element of the success of Coffee Mondolkiri? Uh, you can translate, of course. Okay. Uh, ກໍຈົ່ງໃຈຖ້າອ່າຕາມີຈໍານວນຈໍານວນບາດຍັງຕົວບ້ານຈົກໃຈດັ່ງໃດຈ້າ <coughs> Our company focuses on the, the quality. So in Cambodia right now has used the artificial coffee, but our company uh, only to produce the coffee to uh, process and selecting and quality control about the, the, the quality first. So we don't we, we don't do we don't make with uh, any artificial any chemical inside. So we uh, we we produce the uh, the natural given. So I give the natural to the people who use my coffee. Yeah. Business Initiative International Quality Conventions have a long-standing tradition of more than 33 years recognizing and promoting companies and organizations from all over the world. Some of them, such as the Red Cross or Turner Construction, are market leaders. In this case, we have the honor and the opportunity of having another market leader, now from Cambodia, Coffee Mondolkuri, who is not only producing coffee, but I understand you're doing it regionally. You're using coffee beans from Cambodia itself. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, our coffee, so we, we, we use the only the coffee the, the best the, from Cambodia yeah the best company so now we can call the uh, the, the number one coffee in Cambodia so we products our production is the biggest right now in Cambodia and we also have ability uh, for export also. Mr. Lima, we understand that you control the entire chain of production. You not only have farms, but you also produce locally. Yeah. You locally produce the beans there and you also roast them and process them inside Cambodia, which is something different. At the beginning you were explaining that your company realized that Cambodia coffee was produced elsewhere. It was farmed in Cambodia, yeah. but then it was produced outside. What made you decide to change the business model and go into this new innovative format of trying to do things locally and do it there? So we looking in the giant uh, company. So we want to expand our brand name, just to build brand name to, to the international market to know that of what if the quality of the Cambodian coffee. Mrs. Chantillon, and you're out right now selling outside of Cambodia? Thailand and Russia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. We also export to Thailand, Russia, Austria, and also Switzerland. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, and um, in Asian countries, so we export to Korea, 
Japan. It's remarkable because Cafe Mondel Curry is becoming a, a global brand. You're actually aiming at becoming a global product that it's worldwide known around the planet. Mm -hmm. Which one do you think are going to be the three main elements of success for you to achieve that goal in the following five years? Three men for what? The three things that you believe you would need to do to achieve the goal of becoming a real global brand in the next following five years. For five years in the, in, in the future, right? From now on, from, from now? the 2019 until 2024, uh, what do you think you need to do to become a global brand? Uh, so we uh, join in the advertising, yeah. So uh, in Cambodia right now for the, the, the digital marketing is not popular because uh, it's uh, because uh, all main, many company so don't use the digital marketing in in the 2008-2009 because of the internet so not fully cover in Cambodia but in 2011 2000 yeah the internet so have many ISP uh, start to come and uh, people start to have the internet so we are focused on digital marketing, so to promote uh, coffee, to promote the product, not only coffee, but many companies start to use the digital marketing, you know? Yeah, they start uh, uh, to be my company brand, start to be uh, international market, start knowing me, that uh, who is on my company, yeah. Mrs. Chantillon, uh, do you think that there is, being a family business as it is, yeah. do you think that there will be more generations in the future leading Coffee Mondolkiri? Again, sir? Do you wish to turn it into a corporation or you want to remain as a family business for the future? ចាអានឹងខ្ញុំចង់ចាប់ដៃគូទៅក្រៅប្រទេសអាបានច្រើនដើម្បីយើងពង្រីខ្លួនឲ្យទៅជាក្រុមហ៊ុនមួយដែល